saying the other day that there's so much that goes into being an NFL cornerback other, other than coverage, which everyone thinks about. Like, can you cover the wide receiver? Like how to get aligned, your depth, reading formations. Uh, I assume some of this was you, had, you dealt with in college, but is this a, a different level of detail? Yeah, i say it's, it's, it's very different because, you know, every every little detail is, is very important. You know, it could just be a split of a second, and then if you off by a yard, that's a catch or even a touchdown. You know, so it, it plays a big part in everything. Was it surprising? Oh, yeah, it was very surprising. I thought it was actually going to be the same as college, just a little bit faster. But it's actually more detailed than anything. Coach Hundlin gives you a lot of close coaching. Uh, how, how are you sort of uh, receive that? I mean, do you like the fact that he's paying a lot of attention to you and coaching you up after? Oh, yes, 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 sir. Um, just being that uh, person that's always coachable, you know, it's always great to pick up new things and just learn from everybody else. And when everybody else add add into it, my my ears are just always open. You get to go against Brandon Ayuk sometimes, De Debo Samuel. How is it, um, how's your learning been uh, helped by going against really good guys like that? Oh, it's actually a blessing because every loss I, do, I just go back and learn from it, you know, with them being guys that have been making plays in the NFL already and just just being able to compete with them is just a blessing to me. Did you face Brandon in college? Yeah, I, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. We actually, yeah, we faced two times, yeah, my, in, while I was in college. Uh, yeah, the first time I played him is when, I think it was his first year at Arizona State. And then the second time was, yeah, obviously his second second year. How much has he improved since you faced him back in college? Uh, he's he's definitely improved a lot. You know, uh, college it was more like, you know, he was he was the man. I mean, he still is the man, but you know, college he was uh, he was more like, not really. He was a receiver. He was he was a playmaker though. So I see him here. He's much more as a receiver. Like his his length, size, speed, strength, his ability to adjust to adjust to the ball. You know. It don't get no better than that. How are Jason Barrett and Kaywan Williams leaders in your room? How are they? Oh, those, those guys, I look at those guys as big brothers. You know, they always helping me, you know, with the little things, just telling me the little things count and just paying attention to detail and just showing me, like, how to scheme an offense. Is there, anyone, is there one thing in particular that they've shown you that has been, like, eye-opening for you? Uh, just telling me that I don't have to be so fast in my back pedal. You know, I can just slow up because a lot of teams is not going to just take you deep all the time. You can be able to sit on routes sometimes. Are you, are you finding, I guess initially, I know like OTAs early in training camp, you had to think so much about, okay, where am I supposed to be, what am I supposed to do? Um, you know, is that becoming more second nature so you can play naturally? Or is it still a work in progress? Uh, I'm actually getting more comfortable with finding out where I got to be and what I got to do. Uh, it was actually in OTAs. It was it was crazy. It was like a culture shock. You know, I was like I was I didn't even know where to go. Like me and Ambry was following each other. Like we didn't know where to go. And then I remember Coach Hightower uh, screaming at Jimmy. It was like, Jimmy, take them under your wing. And then we just followed Jimmy everywhere. So it was it was kind of funny. Yeah. Nice to have someone like Ambry to kind of go through all of this with. Oh yeah, that, that's a blessing. Also, you know, just someone that we we competed in high school. We played on the opening together. Uh, we played at the Army Bowl together. So we kind of familiar with each other, and just being able to, to take those steps with someone, with us, someone that's a rookie as me, like me. You guys could, both you and Ambry, um, just, oh, you have the quarterback depth to could, could play off this year. I mean, do you feel like there's Urgency from the coaches. Is everyone to make sure you guys are, are ready and up to speed? Uh, I mean, when when the opportunity presents itself, I think we'll be ready. You know, uh, we just taking it one day at a time and just learning as much knowledge as we can. You know, so when our number is called, we can go out and make plays.